Yeah, again, again, lovely left hook there, right hand, and then he, he switches to the body. Again, right hand there, puts him on the, puts him on the floor. They're going to look a little bit low there with left to the body, but that doesn't matter. He keeps throwing the shots. Again, they'll see he's up and down the ladder with the body shots. Right hand puts him on his back. He gets him too early, Teddy. Again, they're doubling up with the left hook. Accuracy. They're, they're fantastic. They're good shots. They're good, clean shots for the first knockdown. That puts him in the pressure straight away. As in good, gets him too early. Then he just piles over there. Again, accuracy, power, taking his time, not getting too close to Teddy can hold. Teddy tries to hold forward. So bad takes a little step back, hits him again on the way down. And the referee then, because he got him too early, still in steady on the legs, not firing back. The referee's got to step in. He's got to step in. Well, Tete didn't like it. I think, though, that uh, the referee's made an absolutely correct decision. You can see the reaction. He's annoyed at that, but he can't believe it. Can't believe it, but... I think that the referee has stopped him there from getting a very, very bad knockout indeed. So here's Thomas Trimer. Ladies and gentlemen, here is the official time. Two minutes, ten seconds of round number one. Our referee, Mark Lyson, stops the contest as the red corner was in no position to continue. Therefore, your winner, and now the Commonwealth and WBO International Heavyweight Champion, Triple D, Daniel Dynamite Dubois!